Indiana State Senator Brett Walz and a casino executive now face federal charges. Authorities claim the two violated federal campaign finance laws. CBS 4's Kelly Rinke explains the charges. A more than 20 page indictment lists multiple charges against John Keeler, a casino executive for New Centaur LLC, and former Indiana State Senator Brent Waltz. The FBI executed search warrants at their homes yesterday. Court records claim Keeler worked with a man named Kelly Rogers, a political consultant for Waltz's 2016 congressional campaign. The indictment says Keeler used New Centaur to transfer thousands of dollars from its accounts to Rogers, who then contributed the money to the campaign. According to charging documents, Rogers did that by recruiting several straw donors to each contribute $2,700 to Walt's campaign. A straw donor is someone who contributes to a campaign but receives a reimbursement from someone else. Investigators claim Rogers, the consultant, reimbursed the straw donors using the money from Keeler's company, New Centaur. It's very clearly illegal to use a straw donor. Brendan Glavin works for the Campaign Finance Institute. He cannot comment on this specific case, but Glavin's knowledge of campaign finance laws allows him to provide some context. Corporate contributions have been uh, banned in federal uh, elections for uh, a very long time and under the um, thought that uh, corporations making direct contributions to candidates uh, could have uh, undue influence uh, on the candidates' policymaking. Documents also accuse Rogers of transferring a large portion of the new Centaur cash to Waltz, and then Waltz recruited more straw donors to contribute to his campaign. The indictment says Waltz either reimbursed or paid these straw donors in advance. In Indianapolis, I'm Kelly Rinke, CBS 4 News. Kelly, thank you. Investigators claim that Waltz and Keeler hid these illegal contributions from campaign officials, which caused those officials to unintentionally file false reports with the Federal Election Commission. A man in 